So, oh, I wanted to quickly give you guys uh, an acne update. Um, yo. That's the last of it, dog. That's all of it. There's one right there, too. If you can see it, probably not. But. Mm. Anyways, so I <laughs> literally, <laughs> like, didn't have, like, prepared food to eat. So I'm literally, like, so spoiled that, like, my mom has always cooked for me three times a day. Uh, my whole entire life and um, she's not here so I've been having to shop outside like for, and do my own grocery shopping which I've never ever done before in my whole life and I've been having to do this and then um, like cook basically for myself and I don't know how to do either of those two things. I'm like literally paralyzed of that. And so, or disabled, whatever. And um, to do that stuff. And so I, I, I literally the last thing that I had for food left in my house was like this much, this much mac and cheese and this much, even less cauliflower and Parmesan soup. It was so delicious, by the way, whatever I had left, I had like a few drops left over and I had to, I ate those two things, the mac and cheese and the cauliflower and Parmesan um, soup. And of course I was still hungry right so i ate those two things and then i was like um sitting over here in my chair and i open up my curtains and stuff and like the, let the sunlight in it was like so cool um i really think my like house is really really beautiful and stuff um but yeah so i let the sunlight in for a little bit then i get tired and i go to sleep so um i went to sleep and i when I was like when I opened the curtains up like before that I was like just sitting in my chair and I was like thinking that I was gonna tell my cousin to come over to my house um, um, but he and he like you know how sometimes like if you know somebody especially if they're you know you're um, you're related or I don't know how to describe it but anyways you can tell they're around you like they're nearby like for me at least my relatives I can always tell if <laughs> if my relative is somewhere near me and and so oh my god there's literally something in my eye and I could just like tell they were probably just around my house somewhere um because I gave him my address and stuff like yesterday um when I was over there so anyways and they were like anyway so um, I decided like I wanted to call them up and just be like hey just come over but then I decided not to do that because my house um, isn't the cleanest at the moment and I just feel like that would be like rude to like you know invite them over into like a, a messy unclean place especially for me if it's like involving my family and stuff um so I was like <laughs> so anyways so then I decided against that. I closed my blinds to my curtains and then I just go to bed and I just hit the hay. And I wake up at like five o'clock finally. Like I was like, okay, I'm super, super hungry because it's all I had to eat. And then I just like grab all my shit and I just like go over to my cousin's house because I wanted to go see them. And um, I go over there and I went to see them and they were like, yeah, we were just like driving around in your area or whatever, like near your house and stuff. And I was like, I knew you were there, um, I think. And anyway, um, yeah, so I was there from like literally 730 because I had, um, I have classes until December. So I'll have classes for like another like four, three or four months now, um, until December, whatever, however long that is. And so I can't really see them like I would normally, like if I didn't have any classes and if I wasn't taking any classes. Um, 
I would be seeing them like obviously I would be way more spoiled with it but I can't because I'm like on a very like strict schedule um with my homework and everything due and because like my desktop computer for example my Mac isn't over there I can't do you know all of my work and if I did what would be the point of being over there if I was just gonna be working the whole time you know I think it would just be rude um to like you know you know drop everything that I was doing and like just pay attention to my class my homework and stuff so um yeah I was like um anyway um so I just like go there and see them like normally it'll be like late like later in the evening like around seven or something um just absolutely want to have like free time um which will be around then and then i'll just like stay over there um i can't really sleep over there because of like um you know i have i don't know if i cut off or not but um i can't really like sleep over there because like it's um uh, what was I saying? Because I have like class in the morning, like at 8 o'clock in the morning. Um, it's 2.20 now, so I'm going to be going to sleep and then like getting up um, like around 6 or 7 to wake up for to go to my classes tomorrow. And I have classes all day, so I'll be like super tired. And if I'm sleeping over um, somewhere where it's not my house, I sleep like really, really hard, like a rock, you know? And when I sleep like... <laughs> everything else around me completely like you can ask any of my friends um anybody that knows me like when I go to sleep I crash like really really hard and it's just weird so I don't like sleeping in, in other people's houses when I'm like that um and you know because of like my I don't know I feel like my medicine and stuff is over here so I can't like be I can't part it I can't be parted from my medications um as well it just it, it uh eats me up like neur like neur neurologically and so yeah I'm kind of like bound to um my own like um uh my own like you know living situation so that's why i had to come home at least for now and i told them that and and then like i'll be like going to see them like um you know after this four months i have to just get these prerequisites and like the repeater classes done um at least for the next three months or so um, and then I'll be done with, like, this sort of, like, sort of bitchy thing with college right now. It's, like, the in-between phase. I don't know. It's kind of complicated. It's so, so weird. It's like you're learning something new, and it's just, it's scary. Um, but not at the same time. It's just something that... It's sort of like um, adapting change, you know, and um, I don't know. It's like all it is is just like scary, and you know, you just have to like I don't know, not be scared or whatever. Like, just be brave. <laughs> Like, literally. So, anyway. Um, but yeah, that was my day, people. Um, I went over to my cousin's house and I had, like, some omelet with um, two pieces of bread. Two, like, um, like home-cooked, like, non, like, um, butter burrattas. Um, and yeah, that was pretty um and that's about it you know just came home and just chilling with my teddy bear 
I'm gonna like clean up this place and then hopefully like then my cousin and stuff can come over as well. Um, and yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna like show you guys like everything that I'm like gonna do as far as changes to my house and stuff. I feel like there are some people on the internet that um, kind of, um, you know, view my videos or see me on YouTube and um, stuff and they um, try to uh, manipulate like my decisions or um, like how I live my life or like manipulate my personality even. So um, yeah, I, I, I don't know like, um, you know, there's some things that I do have to keep private and so um, I just wanted to like say that. <laughs> Um, and yeah, so it's 2.25. I'm just like gonna finish editing and then I'm gonna upload yesterday's vlog for September the 11th. And yeah, I'm going to close the vlog. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys on the next vlog.